It's a beautiful day on the Isle of Sodor. We've got the Sodor suspension bridge, the resting the air gauge engines and the sidings, Charloe, Reneas, Sir Handel, Peter Sam, Rusty, Duncan, and Fearless Freddy. Here we have Thomas ready to go with his troublesome trucks, Henry, James, Percy, this cranky at the dock for the boat ready to be loaded. And a long hell yeah. Birdie at the crossing. Patiently waiting. There's Gordon on the count of three so he can go by. Birdie likes to deliver his fruit on time. Back here at the coal yard, we have uh Toby getting his coal load for the day. Oh, here comes Thomas. Heading along on a beautiful day on the Owl of Soto. There goes Gordon. There goes Birdie. Oh no! The bridge is out! Thomas crashed on top of Paul's on Birdie! Oh no! Henry didn't know about it! Here comes Henry! Oh no! Here comes James! Is it gonna be another crash on top of all this? Oh my god! The horror! This confusion and delay! Oh no! This is a crash! It's a crossing! Crash! Oh, it's a hammer! The points were switched! Oh, here comes Percy! And Percy, I don't think, knows it's about to be crashed! It's confusion to lie everywhere and here comes Toby with the coal cars. It's really going to be weird. He's going to grab coal all of them. Ah! And here comes Gordon and he's going to fall in even more. Look at this train wreck. This is awful. All the really useful legends today are having a horrible day. And here comes Edward who will make all of them in on the crash. Sir Topham Hat is going to be really pissed off about this. There's much confusion and delay. It's a beautiful but anxious day on the island of Sodor. There's Arthur at the coal mine coming around to get his load of coal. There's Thomas with the troublesome trucks. He's on his way to Brandon Docks. Where Cranky waits with the load from his ship. Murdoch's coming along, running the express. And Emily's making her way up the Sodor Island suspension bridge. Down by the station with her coaches. Emily's a bit anxious because Sir Topham Hatt has brought along a biplane. Little known, Tiger Moth the biplane. Tiger Moth. Tiger Moth, while he is part of the biplane game, is nothing like JJ the jet plane. He isn't useful and certainly doesn't want to do anything. Tiger Moth is lazy and somewhat crazy. And the whole time he's been here, he's been talking to Emily, telling how she's not useful at all and really doesn't do any good for the island. Here is the coal yard, and Arthur is going to get some. Bulgy's waiting at the crossing, and Arthur gets ready to come through, and there goes Bulgy running his bus line. We can see Arthur's long train. Oh, Bulgy's gonna have to stop. They can't have a lot of accidents lately, but they're hoping for none today on the island of Sodor. If Tiger Moth flies by, he's talking to Emily. Oh no! Tiger Moth has broken the Sodor Island's suspension bridge and Emily's had a crash. Wait a minute. It looks like Emily has some ideas of her own about how to take care of Tiger Moth. 
And Emily's trying to make her way through. Oh look, Emily just ran with a push from Thomas. And oh, oh no, there's a huge crash. Emily has broken the coupling from her tender and oh no! The, the suspension branch at the, the cliff branch at the, 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 the tiger moth has flew right into it and now it's destroyed. There's much confusion and delay on the all of the sword or the day. It's a beautiful day on the island of Sodor. Caroline's making her deliveries early in the morning, dropping off passengers and delivering fruit. Over near the docks, Thomas's friends have had a fresh washdown and are ready for a hard day's work. They're glad they've had their washdown since the top of had announced that there won't be any washdowns for seven days. We got Percy, Choby, James, Gordon, Henry, Edward, and Emily. And here is the docks. We have Cranky the Crane having a conversation with Stanley, telling him he's a cranky bug because he hates useful engines. Just past the docks, we have the brand new island of Sordor Chocolate Factory that Sir Topham Hat has finished building. Behind the Chocolate Factory, other useful engines include Duck, Oliver, Toad, Murdoch, Molly, Spencer, Arthur, and Fergus, all ready for a hard day's work. Over near the passenger station, Thomas is ready with a full load of sugar for the chocolate factory for a new batch of chocolates. He's having a conversation with Diesel talking about how much he enjoyed his washdown. As you guys know, you know you saw Thomas Sensor Topham Hat in my video, Hi Hi Puffy Ami Yumi, Ami the Explorer, Trip to a Party, didn't you? Well, you did, because I talked about it on CartoonNetwork.com that it was a crossover of both Thomas and Hi Hi Puffy Ami Yumi. I am a really useful controller, just like Sir Topham Hat. Thomas can use a washdown every day, but I'm sure glad he got one yesterday since the Topham Hat said there won't be another one for a week. Diesels like Diesel don't really need a washdown every day because they're not as useful as Thomas. Diesel hated that comment. He just ignored it. Thomas is ready to head on over to the coal yard to get his coal to take to the chocolate factory to create the chocolate. He stops and waits for his coal load. He's worried he's going to have a tough time getting up the soda suspension bridge with a full load of sugar, but he's going to do his best. He heads up to the bridge. Oh, he's having a hard time already, but he makes it to the top a little bit after. He comes around over the top of the suspension bridge by the new chocolate factory and stops at Brendan Dock with Stanley and Cranky for a moment. And again, Cranky tells them both that they're cranky bugs. Time to head to the chocolate factory. Switch, points are switched, and Thomas heads to the chocolate factory by way in the passenger station in the fruit stand. Caroline's waiting so she can make her next fruit delivery. Thomas makes it through the switch and through the tunnel. Like, oh no, there's all on the track. Thomas doesn't see it. The driver can't stop. Oh no, will he, cr will he crush it to the chocolate station? Oh my god! That's chocolate all over Thomas! And Diesel's coming around but doesn't see the oil on Thomas! Oh my god! The horror! The crash! There's chocolate everywhere! And then this is coming to the wall! Caroline doesn't want her! She's coming to the tunnel with the oil of school! She won't be able to stop either! Much confusion and delay, so Top of Hat won't be happy at all. Thomas is covered with chocolate and sugar and won't be able to get a wash down for seven days. Diesel's got sugar all over him, and Mavis is completely out of control with oil all over her. There's much confusion and delay on the island of Sodor today, and you will be really upset that Sir Topham Hat is going to be extremely pissed off.